we just got to this parking lot and that thing right there looks pretty low and i haven't tested it with my lifted car yet so hopefully we can fit guys we're gonna find out right now together if we can fit let's see all right whoa okay guys, went over the speed bump real quick oh am i gonna make it am i gonna make it Oh. What's up, Ma fam? A lot of us have been staying home all the time because of quarantine and just everything that's been going on during this pandemic. And because of that, people like Leia, the parents, Roy's inside the house playing and doing a lot of fun stuff. Are you having fun inside the house? I think so, yeah? <laughs> She's having a lot of fun, but that also means that our living room and our house just gets so messy because yep. she, she's just always playing with everything. So our house is a mess and there's way too many toys in our living room. And we're trying to figure out how to make this place a lot better. The kids are kind of taking over the house and we want our house back. And I'm sure you guys feel the same. And it's kind of like pulling out our hairs every night. We have them clean and then when we wake up, it's all messy again. So. I think what we need to do is figure out how to get toy storage. Yes. Maybe all this stuff, uh, we can put some storage over there or we should start using Leia's own room. So this is Leia's room and she doesn't play in here too much. She does a lot of her Zoom meetings in here or Zoom classes, but I think we can put some storage space over here and start putting our toys away. But basically whether we're outside in the living room or in her room, it's pretty messy. So the goal for today is fixing up the house, do a little organizing. And, uh, you know, I've been a little inspired because Joe moved in and he's doing a lot of housework and getting his room situated. So I feel like we need to do the same. All right. So Joe has been at our place for about two weeks now, and I know he's been doing a lot of stuff. We still have boxes outside. There's been a lot of trash, but Christina wanted to see what it's been looking like. And I'm kind of excited to see what the space looks like so far. Welcome! We're building. We got all of this stuff to match. Wow. Nice. You see this? It's matching. It's matching. It's wow. matching. Wow. You could have that. Oh, you want to take that bookshelf? Yeah, you could take it. Sure. We have so many books for Leia. And it will match your guys' house because you have so many great things already. This is nice. I like how you pick the same colors to match our cabinets already. He picked it. There he picked it. Ah. Oh. Man, so man. What are you doing there? It's not done yet, dude. <laughs> no, no, no. So we're trying to get some inspiration because we're about to head out to Ikea gotcha, and gotcha. get uh, some stuff to organize our living room for the kids. And I just want to see what you guys have done so far. And it looks very homey. Uh, I know there's still a lot of boxes everywhere, but it's looking Come good. Like, check it out. He's got a walk-in closet, guys. And he's able to fit a bunch of drawers like three drawers already it's, it looks so spacious in here what are you building right now hey oh he got the floor all wet yeah, he's not even allowed in here has he been sleeping with you um, i don't let him in because i want it to be clean and he needs to know boundaries that's true so Apparently, he, called me the, the male, Mary he didn't know. All of this is uh, not my doing. I am a big mess. And uh, this is all this guy. But he's teaching me how to look at things in a more artistic but functional way. So if you guys don't know Darian, uh, he's very creative. And he's, he, he just knows everything about fashion. And I think it's because he's a photographer. But he's just really good at everything that he does. So. We all trust his judgment on how everything looks. Functional and, over form, guys. Right. And they put this shelving up here, like which is, shelves. right? I like the colors. Just, and we recycled this from uh, the JK office. Oh, cool. Oh. Darren was like, this, this, this. And I was like, all right, put it in the cart. He had the vision. What do you know about toy storage and toy organizations? Toy organizations? Yeah. I don't know, man. I think there's a lot of cubby boxes. OK. To tuck them away, yeah. That's great. So I guess I'm a professional at uh, knowing about fashion and stuff because I was thinking about cubbies for the house. Hi. He's been talking to me this whole time. 
You want to have a conversation all day, huh? Wait, 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 wait. Are you ticklish? Tickle, tickle, tickle. No, no. Tickle, tickle, tickle. I saw this thing on their newly built, uh, built shelf. And I'm thinking, is this a hot pot contraption here? Or is it an urn that I'm touching? <laughs> oh, it's definitely a hot pot. <laughs> Alright, so Darian said he wanted two of our house and he's offering to organize our house in exchange for something that I don't want to give up, <laughs> which is my arcade set. I want this bro because I want this game. The Final Fight 1944 is a must for my collection, bro. So that's it man, that's an easy payout, man. You know, organize your whole house and I get the whole arcade, bro. <laughs> <laughs> does that sound fair? I don't know. I mean, it does sound fair, but it's also something that I really like. That I don't play much, but you don't play. I love it though. I love this guy. I mean, maybe we'll give this to him, and then we we'll have to buy Think like about uh, Think about it. we'll have to buy a Street Fighter one instead. I'm now. I'm 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 Oh, just like that. Uh, hey, um, can you do something for me? Can you clean? Can you sweep it up for me? She's wow. like, that's just a toy, it's not for real. I want. <laughs> <laughs> See, see Leo, that's how you clean. That's how you use your broom. Oh man. See this? Now Darius cleaning. He's trying to he's trying to butter butter me up so he can take the arcade home. See this? All oh, <laughs> is it you working? See you don't just throw stuff in it. You don't put just stuff in. You gotta clean the corners and the cracks. Yeah, there we go. You know, you may not you may not see the dirt. But in my mind, I see it. Yeah. In my mind, <laughs> Thank yes. you, Mario Kondo. Wow. <laughs> Just like that. Ta da! We now we need to level up and get more books to read. There you go. Oh, we're learning so much. Mm. First step of organizing huge props to all the parents who have kids, especially the ones who have more than one kid. We're finally going to Ikea and uh, it's, it's taking us almost, it's taking us over two hours and uh, we're on the way to Christina's parents' house to drop off the kids so we can spend time at Ikea together. You know, normally during the pandemic, it's just me uh, going to places by myself, but this time I was like, why don't we both go? And since your parents are available to watch the kids, why don't we take advantage of that? So we're doing that and um, it's just, man, it's rough. Like, almost three hours later, we're finally getting to do what we wanted. So Joe's gonna meet us at Ikea with Darian because he's got oh, some cool. more stuff to get for uh, his living space. So wow. we're gonna get to do some roomy stuff today. I know, this is gonna be our first roomy adventure. Yeah. And to many more. And it's crazy because now when we get to finally do something, I'm so beat and tired from putting all the kids stuff into the back and then packing the backpack that like my energy level has gone down so much yeah so that's why i'm like huge props to all the parents that can do this all the mm -hmm. time like i need <laughs> we need help <laughs> so let us know how your parents do it write down in the comments some easy tricks uh to get us you know i guess more energy some parenting hacks or something yeah <laughs> i know one way to feel a little more relaxed and that's by listening to red hot chili peppers We just got to the parking lot and that thing right there looks pretty low and I haven't tested it with my lifted car yet. So hopefully we can fit guys. We're going to find out right now together if we can fit. Let's see. All right. Whoa. Okay, I went over the speed bump real quick. Oh. Am I going to make it? Am I going to make it? We did it! Woo! I was holding my breath the whole time. That, I was so nervous. I didn't think we were going to make it. It's almost like our first date. Is it? It's our first date since the pandemic. This is not how I envisioned our first date to be. <laughs> but oh, okay. looks like we're on a double date. <laughs> What's up dudes? We're on a double date right now. Ikea date? No. <laughs> because I'm this bit. Yeah, I got one too. <laughs> Man, my magic tape is bigger than yours. No, mine's already longer. No. <laughs> no. 
Look, mine is longer. Mine is longer. No, mine is longer. We cannot take you anywhere. Oh, wow, that's embarrassing. He lives. He lives. It's been a while. <laughs> Bro, how many people be laying on that bed? We're in quarantine, dude. Sleeping on everyone else's bed. The guy with the dirty hat don't care how many people have slept oh, on this bed. Is already? <laughs> Joe said, this look like a doo-doo stain. E. So we got to the most important section, which is the cubby section. And this is what we're looking for, for Leia's room to put all the toys in there, organize it, kind of put some like, um, one of those baskets in there so it can kind of fold kind of like this guy right here it's got a basket you know but darian is saying to get it as high as possible you want to use the entire wall not the entire wall completely and almost i know you guys man you guys have a brand new kid you need extra cubbies a brand new kid. <laughs> yeah. and you're gonna need extra space to hide all your toys so you're okay with getting like a big one like this I mean, do we need all these apartments looking at you guys i don't know yet <laughs> <The more> like, <laughs> we have a lot of stuff huh? the compartment the better See, if we if we do this then that means less stuff in the living room like all the stuff that's in there now we can get rid of it a lot of the stuff in the living room are things for enzo which is like a table that he can stand on yeah or a huge swing things that don't fit into a cubby this is more for leia's like little development toys her stuffed animals or blocks you know True. stuff like that so we're still gonna have a messy living room just a more organized leia room sometimes i wish our house looked something like this where it was completely different i mean it's so beautiful the way the green stands out Joe said he feels like he's in London time. How do you say Leia's name if you were living in London? Leia! Alright, he's testing out his new kitchen. Would you like some crumpets? Uh, I want some boba actually. That's how I've been making boba during the pandemic. You rolling it out? Yeah. Oh. Tiffin cake vibes over here. Whoa, this place looks amazing. This is awesome. It's like a patio area. Hey, we need something like this for the back. What do you think? Yeah. I agree. Look at this thing. Right? Yeah. Wow. Like this. That's tight. Is this all and waterproof? You, you have a, a projector thingy here. This yeah. could go right behind your house where the um, platform area is. Mm. Wow. What a beauty. If it's shaded too, and then it's like an extra room. Yeah. That's yeah. true. We've actually been wanting to make a patio area in our backyard, but the things that have been stopping us is one, Christina gets bit all the time by the mosquitoes, but we need excess amounts of candles. Yep. And then two, we're just always dreaming of expanding the back and adding an addition to the house. Oh, yeah. But Dude, that, that won't happen for a while. So I'm just like, this is pretty nice to have in the back. Look how cute this little chair is. Oh my goodness. Oh I don't want to sit on it like, Anything like, miniature is so cute. Leo I just picture I, Enzo sitting in here. Leia would love this. I know. That would be her chair. Oh. Christina. Look. It's so small, right? I know. And it's a rocking one too. Oh, oh it's a rocking one. Oh. oh, how cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, does this make you want to have another baby already? I thought you said we wouldn't have one. No, we're good. We still have a baby, even though he's so big. But don't you want another baby that can go in here and swing? No. <laughs> Alright, so not only have we been trying to organize stuff for the house, we we're trying to make it look a lot nicer and more decorative. So we've been in this plant section for the last like almost one hour. And she's picking this little, uh, what are these flowers? I don't know, they look like cherry blossoms to me. Almost, it's really pretty. Yeah, I love it. So, I know we've always talked about getting um, fake plants for the house because real plants just have bugs and stuff like that. So we've decided to do this and we never wanted to spend the money for it. But I think now that we're always home, like it just makes sense for us to make it a lot nicer and make it more comfortable for us to like, you know. So I think this is gonna make our, our lives more vibrant and it's gonna make the house look a lot different too. So she's trying to mimic this vase here and I think this vase looks really beautiful. 
She's kind of scared that Enzo is going to break it, but we just got to make the house look nicer. So we got to try. All right, so we just spent the last two hours at Ikea. Two hours, guys, two hours. And uh, they sold out of the cubbies, which is the whole reason why we came to Ikea. I think because everyone's at home, they have the same idea as us. Probably because they're going crazy too and they want to try to make their house look a little bit better since we're all home. But either way, we still have a lot of stuff here. We got a lot of plant stuff, which is going to be pretty exciting. All right, we have one row of books left. I think this is Leia's new favorite spot. Yeah, she came here as soon as she saw that you were putting all the books here. Yeah, and we gotta get more books for her. And then we gotta put our books up here. Yeah. So we gotta read more. Yes, we do. We gotta take time to read. So to take time to read, that means I need uh, an editor. Um, I need an assistant, uh, a, a chef, and uh, a nanny in the house. So yeah, we have more right. time. So after going to Ikea, uh, one of my favorite things that we got there uh, is the plants. We got a lot of plants. So there's one that's really tall and uh, I want to put that together. Enzo, stop yeah. climbing on me. Yeah. Yeah, oh man. Book. Where'd you get this book from? <laughs> she probably got it right in front of you and we didn't even know. What the? Like it. Are we reading every book right now, Leia? <laughs> oh, this, maybe this was a bad idea. Uh oh. I'm leaving. Bye, Leia. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look Whoa! At how the faces. That's huge. Oh, it's, wow. Okay. It's beautiful though, guys. Look. It is. Look how big it is. It's all it's past your knees. Dang, it's like almost oh, it's to my butt. Wow, what a lucky vase. <laughs> okay, well we had to get this because look at how tall these things are that we're getting. I I'm actually surprised because I know you said that this is your favorite piece. And I didn't think you were gonna be into like something like this. She doesn't know that I customize these Christmas flowers that we have up there. I like customizing stuff. I always buy a bouquet and then I spread it around the house. Yeah. Oh, I just didn't know if it was like too feminine for you because it's all pink and stuff. Well, that's nice. Yeah, right? I really like it. I feel like it just kind of like changes the atmosphere a little bit already. You like it, huh? Did your parents ever get these and hit you with it? No, they used to spank me with things that wouldn't break. So they're very, very thin twigs. And uh, no, they would never spank me with that. Oh. They would use something a lot thicker. My parents used to go to the trees and we would all be so dumb. And we'd be, me and my brothers would be sitting here and we'd be like, okay, oh no, they're going to get the tree branch. They're going to shave all the leaves off and we're going to get whipped with it. And we, we didn't even hide. Like we just sat there and we took it. And yeah, this is um, bringing back some not so fun memories. Guys, in the Asian culture, if you guys don't know, um, spanking is normal. We're not talking about abuse, child abuse, none of that stuff. It's just strictly uh, spanking if we needed some discipline. Oh, you can use all of that, huh? I'm gonna try to put it in and then um, try to put the flowers in between it. Let's see. Oh, there's so many. Oh, yeah. Do a little bit at a time. Oh my goodness. Whoa, they're pretty much touching the ceiling. Oh my. Goodness. Wow. wow. That's pretty. Oh, that's pretty. That looks nice. What do you think? I think that's pretty cool. Ooh, I like it. Me too. Good job. Good pick. High five. All right, we did it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you guys learned uh, some stalling tips and housing stuff too that we did. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video and hopefully you will see a bunch of new decor Whoa. in the house. I hope so. Let me show you guys real quick what the Y looks like. <laughs> it's taller than me. I feel like it's taller than what it looked like in the store. All right, guys, till next time. See ya. <laughs> Smash face. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Say thank you. Thank you. Say I love you. I love you.